Hello everybody, and welcome back to Quick Plays. So, uh... Today on Quick Plays, we're going to be playing something that's kind of weird for my childhood. This is Kid Chameleon. Uh, this is a two-player game, but I do not have... Oh, it's two-player alternating. I don't have a second player with me right now. So, uh, I don't really need to see this, but I'm just showing it, whatever. There's a British comic co <laughs> Did you know, from 1970 to 72, there was a British comic book starring camouflage using a lad called Kid Chameleon. That has nothing to do with this. Thanks. Yeah, the box art is very crowded. And also very 90s. I don't know if the game itself tells you the story, but I'll read it just from here. So, Kid Chameleon, it's a 1992 game. When a highly advanced virtual reality game called Wildside uh, begins to trap kids inside the game, you must play as Kid Chameleon to save the day. Collect helmets along the way to make a kid more powerful and transform into new forms. I forgot to press start. Yeah. Oh, okay, it does tell us. Okay, well, while it's saying this, what I'm going to say is, it's weird for us because it came up occasionally on Sega Channel. I've mentioned I had that before. And it's... I, we had played it whenever it came on, but we never could find it ourselves to play. Like, it was never up for rent or anything. So we either had to wait for it to come out on Sega Channel, or, if we were lucky, we would go to a friend's house who happened to have it, and that would be the only thing we ever did there. We went up there and played Kid Chameleon. <laughs> because it's a... F I've said this a lot today, but it's a good game. It also has this interesting mechanic where you grab helmets inside of the game to transform. Uh, and start two, I assume it's your two player. I'm not even going to bother with options, let's just start one. An interesting thing about this game, I don't know if I'm going to really be able to show it off, is that uh, there's a bunch of pads. Like, there are... Uh, oh, okay, there's no attacks for uh, just the kid. Like, there are tons of pads you can take in this game. Like, uh, there, there was a count somewhere of how many unique pads you could take through this game, and it's like, there is just a lot. Uh, like, you could technically go straight forward to the end in each level, and that's viable. But, like, if you play your cards right, you could just get through the level, level, skip through to the final level, like, really quickly by knowing the right paths to take. Also, you have different amounts of health, depending on what character you're playing as, and, of course, different abilities. Um... Okay, that's jump. Wait, what? What is his ability? <laughs> wow! I thought this was the guy that could charge, but I guess not. Okay. Or these black blocks. Black blocks are very bouncy. Ah, uh, thanks. Okay, I mean he could run, but he doesn't. He doesn't have a charge attack, which I thought he did. But I guess not. Yeah, the main draw of the game is all the different transformations, which uh, I'll show off when I can find them. And there's the end to each level, but there's, of course, teleport pads, like I mentioned. <coughs> if I could remember where they are, that'd be nice, but I don't remember where they are. Also, the enemies are really weird. Okay, now here we have the Shinobi Ninja. I s oh, no, the Samurai. <laughs> I just assume it's Shinobi Ninja, because I keep thinking of sh the game Shinobi. Oh, was was the uh, knight the guy who can uh, climb on walls? Because I know there's a guy who can climb walls. Yeah, if you run out of health as one of the transformations, you just turn back into the kid. But the kid cannot actually attack. Like, maybe he can jump on enemies, but I'm not going to risk that right now unless I have to. Excellent. Okay, well, that was my fault. Yeah, I guess one of the other advantages of the knight is he had a lot of health as opposed to the Samurai, who only has three health. Which I've already wasted most of, again. Ooh. Okay, well, there's one of the teleports. So this is one you're probably going to get normally. Can I... Can I activate it, please? Thank you. Oh, it just teleports me here, I guess. Okay, I can't bounce on that, but it doesn't kill him. Okay, I... Had to hit him twice, and it would have killed him. Good to know. There we go. There's the ninja. Samurai. I keep mixing that up because I'm an idiot. I keep hoping I'm going to find a more interesting power-up in one of these. Come 
Come on, guy. The score doesn't exactly matter, so why am I bothering? <coughs> okay, uh, remember there's a new guy here, I think. Come on, where is it? Yeah, there it is. The guy. This is the guy who can charge through walls. Um, am I going any higher? Yes, I am. Okay. Be nice if it went a little faster than that. All right. Well, there's a clock. Which added a whole three minutes into the game. Wow. Okay, well, let's see if this guy can actually climb walls like I guessed. Oh, yeah, he can. Sort of. What? He was able to for a second there. Oh, I have to tap circle. Which I assume would be C on the original game. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, fucking... <laughs> Why? What? I was trying to jump across, and it wasn't letting me. I don't want to get too high or I'm going to hit the spikes. And I couldn't grab on the other wall. Uh, well, I had to take that hit. Okay. I should not have got rid of the knight. I could have just jumped past, I guess. Oh, I have plenty of time left on the clock now. Oh, that was my fault. Oh no. Yes, thank you. <laughs> tap, tap, tap on those buttons. Oh, the freaking sludge guys. Shouldn't have taken that. Maybe I guess I should have because it lets me go through here. Yeah, there we go. Secret passage. Are there any helmets in here hiding? Or is it just for jewels? Is it really just for jewels? That's kind of unfortunate. Like they have the super secret hidden area. Get up there, guy. What? How do I... Okay, what? There we go. That's better. <coughs> Hopefully I can find a more interesting area to get to. Nope, we're still in this world. And then there's the glob hand things. Do we have a new helmet in here? No, just the ninja again. Samurai. Okay, just two samurai. Okay, just health refill. That's helpful, I guess. Ah! Oh no! One hit away from death. There's a teleport right there, but it's past one of those glob hands. Do I press up? There, there we go. Oh, I remember this area! Does this have the surfboard thing? Uh, well, maybe if I can actually go up there. It would be nice if I actually bothered to do this properly.
Okay, yeah, it's basically bonus area, and I assume one of those has something very useful in it. If the game will let me up there. Oh no! No! Freaking game! There it is! Yes! This guy. Uh, if I can activate... Yeah, the tornado guy. Okay, it's not the surfboarder. Yeah, this guy who just pretty much fly around wherever he wants. <coughs> oh, I remember this area. Oh, yes, yes, there's the Jason mask. Um, there we go. And now, uh, yeah. Like, uh, seriously. Uh, yeah, there's just so much hidden in this game that it's just so fun. Where do I go from here? I guess I, I, guess I go up, that would make sense. Okay, if I can actually get up. No, you don't. See, Jason, you are not built for play- oh, this is a path. Okay. Jason, you were built for death, not for uh, platforming. Oh, what's this? This is just coins. Yeah. Okay. Ice physics. Well, well that's a problem. Freaking that game. You Hey, I actually made it to the end of the level. I'm surprised I've lived this long. <coughs> Come on. Thank you. What? Oh, okay, I was over there. I was expecting me to be on the other side of the screen. Oh, this guy! Yes, the guy in the death tank! It's a very weird transformation. And then I just lost it. Fantastic. Oh good, I am in a pit of death. <laughs> well, let's fool around with that thing a little longer before we end this off. Oh, this is such a silly transformation. There's so many silly transformations in this game. Oh no, 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 no! Really? Okay, whoa, oop. just a little more. I can make it this time, I promise. Do I just have to go down here, actually? I can't go down there with the death tank. Oh, they specifically designed it so you can't go down there unless you're normal. Okay. Okay, let's platform this carefully. What is in that? It's probably not worth it, whatever it is. Yeah, it's just a gem. This guy has such a huge hitbox, too. I swear, if this is just death down here... Okay, no, it's not. What?! Okay, that was not my fault. <laughs> that was, though. Uh, I can use a continue, I guess. Uh, okay, you know, th this is just good enough to leave it off on. So, yeah. Kid Chameleon is a very interesting game, with such a very... I probably should have gone down there, check it out. It has a very unique... Uh, yeah... Gimmick to it, I guess you could say. I like it, it's kind of fun. Whoops. There we go. Now, let's see what's down here, is it just a death pit? Yeah, it's a death pit, thanks! Let's just see what's down here, the path. Oh, there's actually a teleporter down here! You know what? Now that I've broken those blocks... 
I can actually bring him down to the teleport. Strategy. I guess I'm not done yet. I just actually want to see what the hell is going on here. <laughs> wow! Wow! Okay. Okay, I was trying to remaneuver myself and I just killed myself. You know, this is not the best showing I have ever <laughs> displayed in my gaming career. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay, yeah, I see what you're supposed to do. Yeah, they were not recommending you come in here with the uh, General Skull guy. Okay, that was just dumb right there. Oh, they want you to platform across here, don't they? Yep. Okay, that, that actually wasn't too bad, now that I know what to do. What I'm more worried about is platforming on this. See? Yep. I knew that was going to happen right there. Oh, I'm determined to get to the teleporter at the end of this room. Careful. I did it! Alright, and now I'm just back in this world. <laughs> Oh, is there any transformations I can use? Yeah, there's Jason again. Oh, I remember this room. Okay. Yeah, I'm not going to be getting through this anytime soon. Yeah, thanks everybody for watching, and as soon as I die, we will see you next time, because this is not going to end very well. Wow.